Hello, these are your government notices for today, Friday, November 20th, 2020. I am Carleen Peters. As of December 1st, 2020, all travelers to Grenada will be required to complete an online application in order to receive a Pure Safe Travel Authorization Certificate to enter the island. The certificate is a health clearance authorization. The Government of Grenada, through the Ministry of Health, has partnered with an Amber Group, a technology company, to create a comprehensive, user-friendly, secure, and efficient online application that will enhance the border protocols for entry into Grenada. The difference with this new system is that it is interactive and inclusive, requiring that all health and other relevant information be entered and submitted digitally. The process is also easier and less time consuming. Incoming passengers will also be able to upload their certified negative test results onto the form for one completed and secure submission. The Ministry of Health reassures the public that the Pure Safe Travel Authorization is one added layer of security designed to further protect the Tri Island State from an outbreak of COVID 19. The Grenada Tourism Authority and the TA Marishaw Community College signed a Memorandum of Understanding to formalize and deepen their well-established partnership with the aim of enhancing the education of students in the Tourism and Hospitality Department. The Memorandum of Understanding formalized a scholarship program in the Tourism Studies Management Department the contribution of the GTA will continue to make an impactful enhancement to the quality of the tourism and hospitality curriculum. The student experience and internship placements and student preparation for the workforce. A new program is coming to the Government Information Service. It's called Insight into Karaku and P.T. Markney. It's a production of the Government Information Service and the Ministry of Karaku and P.T. Martinique Affairs. Stay tuned to this station for more information in the upcoming weeks. The Ministry of Education and the Commonwealth of Learning is providing free access to online courses offered by reputable universities around the world. The courses are offered in the various subject areas such as art, computer science, health, business, social sciences, math, engineering, and language learning. The deadline for registration is November 30th, 2020. For further information and guidance, please contact the Human Resource Development Division at the Ministry of Education on telephone number 440-2737. All registered and licensed fishing vessels are asked to be in their respective areas on the date and time allocated for inspection. All fishing vessels must be equipped with these stipulated safety items as required by the fisheries regulations. The schedule for this week is as follows. Today, Friday, November 20th, 2020, has two locations, Pitibakai 1 p.m. to 2 p.m. and Grenada Marine 2.30 p.m. to 4 p.m. And now for your government reminder. The Ministry of Sports, Culture, the Arts, Fisheries and Cooperatives in collaboration with MVP Track Club holds the final leg of the Cross Country on Saturday, November 21st, 2020. This will be done at the Roy St. John Playing Field at 2 p.m. There will be two categories, under 16 and open, trophies to be awarded to top performers. These have been your government notices for today, Friday, November 20th, 2020. I am Carlene Peters. Until next time.